Okay, yes, today's video is another Shein haul, but stay with me here. In my last video, I guess I didn't answer all of the questions that you guys would have wanted answered before you ordered from Shein, so I've had so many questions, and I just figured I might as well make another video because I had a package come, so. And of course, I am wearing my favorite piece from the last haul, this flannel. I literally live in it. Um, the pink one that I got, not as much. I haven't really worn that that much, to be honest. Um, I don't think I've worn it out of the house anywhere. But this I wear it all the time, it's so comfy. And that was basically the reason I wanted to order, because I wanted more of them in different colors. So, I know what you're thinking. Megan, did you really just buy a bunch of random shit from Shein that you don't need yet again? And the answer is yes. I can't help it, I can't help it. I just love to have a package en route to my house. I don't know what it is. I swear it's a psychological thing where like I get excited, but if you do not care about what is in this bag or any of the questions about Shein that I'm going to answer, then please feel free to not watch. I will not be offended. But if this at all interests you, then let's open some shit up. I'm ready. There's an easy way to open this and I always forget how to do it. Every time I go to open a new package, I'm like, how's that, how's that trick work again that you open this? I never remember, I'm just gonna cut it. it kinda smells like rubber. I think that's just the package, but I don't like it. So pretty much since I ordered this in a few other colors, I already know half the package is going to be good, but I'm gonna show you anyways, because why not? Okay, I'm gonna pull out the thing that I really wanted the most out of this whole haul. Let's do this one. Okay, this is the same as this, but in like a red, as if I needed to be more basic than I already am. I love this color. What did I lose? Oh, it's a spare button. Honestly, that's a really nice gesture and everything, but the odds of me actually sewing a button on are slim to never. Oh, I love it already. Love the color. It's really not that exciting for me because I already have it, but the color is bomb. And obviously same quality as the one I'm wearing. Obsessed. And I just like to say, that we went to Winners the other day and I had three girls in Winners come up to me and tell me that they liked my jacket, asked me where I got it, and then compare it to, well, two of them compared it to other stores around here that sell these for like over $100. And I was like, nope, she and girls. All right, on to the second item. I actually got two of the same thing. And you're gonna be like, why would you do that? Well, oh, it's already coming out. Is it not what I thought it was? So I'm just gonna keep this one over here because it is for my mom. She really liked this on me, so I wanted to get her one. I thought it was black, but it's blue. Oh my God, that's even better. Oh my God, I'm in love. The picture looked black but it's way nicer in blue. Oh my God, I love blue. I'm so excited. I love it. And I did change one thing up though. This is a large and it's like nice and baggy, but I did get mediums this time around because I do think that like it could be a little smaller, you know? I thought it was black, so it was like not an option that I even really wanted. I wanted the red one and then like there was a brown, like beigey one. But they have these like flash sales all the time. If you go on Shein a lot, you'll notice like sometimes things that you have in your cart will just randomly drop in price. And so these were regularly 40, between 40 and $42, depending on which color. And these, the black one, or so I thought, the blue one, um, it went on sale for $28 one day. And so I was like, perfect, with my little coupon code. They ended up being $24, I believe. Let me just double check so that I'm not like 
lying to you guys. Yeah, so each of these was $23.80 for the blue. So I got two of those. One for my mama. And then the red one that I got was $34.85 with the discount. So yeah, I, I paid full price, the, the full $40 for the red one because I really liked it. But I did get the little coupon code. It was either 15%. No, it was definitely 15%. It couldn't have been 20 because um, I only got six bucks off. But yeah, so $34.85 for the red one and $23.80 for the blue ones. I'm so excited now that they're blue. Anyways, um, in this package, I, I see that there's like this. I don't know if you can see that. Um, so it says return process on it. I wonder if they watch my video. No, I'm just kidding. But yeah, it says log in to Shein account, my order, select an order, click return item. I've never had this little card in one of my packages that says how to return something. So maybe that's a sign that like Shein is stepping it up on its return game. So that was one of the questions that I had was um, the return policy. And, and some people, you know, said that they had um, no luck returning something, but that was a while ago. So I want to say that maybe they're doing better at returns. I don't know. I've never tried to return something and I don't know that I will. Hopefully not. Hopefully everything's good, but maybe that's a sign they've upped their return game. I still don't know about that question. Another question that I got was sizing and fit. Um, and it varies. So the company is Chinese itself. Um, I don't know if I said that in the last video because I wasn't 100% sure until this time around I actually went and I checked where it's shipping from. And so it is from China. Um, the reason it doesn't take as long to ship is I think that they use like some kind of expedited service. I'm not sure, but in comparison to things like AliExpress, it's, you know, like a week or so shipping. So it's, it's not like a month or six weeks or anything crazy. But uh, it is China, so their sizing is often a lot different than ours. But I haven't had too much of a problem with it lately. Um, I think that the sizing is pretty accurate, but I always look at the reviews at the bottom. So they will actually give you like discounts, kind of. I think it's like kind of like Shein dollars. So they'll give you like a certain amount of money if you review an item that you bought. So like say it's 20 stars or 20 coins or whatever it is it'll actually go to your next purchase i haven't done that because i'm lazy but it's a good idea because then you get some money off your next purchase anyways that encourages people to leave reviews right so all of the reviews that are on there are legit they're from people and they'll usually show like a picture of the item which i think is super helpful because a lot of the times when you look at what china sites have for the description photo is like a really nice photo and sometimes it doesn't reflect the quality of the actual item um aliexpress is definitely a big culprit for this so definitely look at the reviews and every single individual item you need to look at the reviews that's my warning to you every item is different so Look at the reviews, look at the photos that the reviewer has put, and that'll kind of give you a, like an idea of the texture and stuff. Um, see if the material is good. Okay. This is a purchase that I'm hoping is cute because it looked cute, but I've never bought bralettes or bras on Shein, but I wanted to because they were really cheap. So they look nice. So it was a three pack of little bralettes. It's really cute. I wonder how well it actually like will hold up. I wouldn't say that the quality is like any different than winners or like, where else do you buy bra? Like, I don't know, Walmart. I've just mostly bought in bralettes or like Ardeans. Um, cause I've bought in a couple of bralettes from our Deans or like winners and yeah, they don't feel any different quality wise. Why this one is wrapped and the other one aren't wrapped. I don't know. Oh, this one must be wrapped cause it's white. 
how smart of them. So it feels like decent quality. I don't know. I'll have to try it on and see. They do look kind of tiny. Like, I think that's a large. Well, they're stretchy though, so yeah, that, no, yeah, that might be fine. <laughs> so random. So the bralettes were $14 for three, and I ended up getting them for $11.90 with the discount. So for $12, that's really only $4 a bra. That's pretty much the best deal I found on bralettes. Like winners is usually even like seven, eight bucks a bralette. So it's decent if they're good, if they're good quality, then that's a decent price. Next up, this was a really random order. So I'm sorry if you like, wanted to see a bunch of cool shit. I didn't really get, ooh, it's ecstatic in here as well. I don't like that. I had to get a swimsuit because it was on sale. So. Oh, I hate how everything's staticky right now winter okay so this is the bottom and this is the top I just thought that was really fun A little frillies cute so for the bikini I paid um, it was $13 and then with the discount I paid $9.35 I don't know, man. I'm pretty sure that 935 is an amazing deal for a bathing suit these days. And like the quality is good. Like there's nothing, nothing off about it. Like the sizing, I have always had the most luck with bathing suits. I have never gotten a bathing suit that didn't fit or, you know, had anything weird going on. Like it was every bathing suit I've gotten from there, I would recommend. So Bathing suit, suit shopping on there is always a good idea. But like everything in life, you have to do some research. So if you're buying something off of there because you've seen me talk about it, I'm not vouching for the whole site. Okay, I just wanna throw that out there. When people ask me the quality, I don't know the quality of every item. I just don't know. I only know the quality of the items that I've ordered. Other than that, I don't know quality lately I feel like has been even better than it was before um so in 2019 was when I first ordered some stuff off of there in the summer and I got a couple of cute bathing suits but other than that like some stuff fit weird the quality was kind of not great um the bathing suits have always been good but other than that like uh, hit and miss I had like a couple tops that I liked a lot of tops I didn't um either the si sizing was funky or the texture and like the quality of the material was trash, but um, only like a few times. <laughs> like I only can think of the one dress, I believe it was, that I talked about in the last video. And then I have a couple of tops that the quality is fine on them, but just the fit is funny. Like I'm thinking of one in particular that like ties around the neck and it like ties, I don't know. It just didn't work for me, but maybe it would work for someone else. I don't know. The quality was definitely less, I would say, before. I feel like they've stepped up their game hard and everything that I've gotten lately has been bomb. So that's my answer for the quality. Oh, I got hair scrunchies, I forgot. I know that everybody and their brother sells hair scrunchies now. I know that it's like a big trend and that like you can get the really expensive ones. But honestly, why? Why? Why, 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 why? This whole package of 10 scrunchies cost me, I'll tell you how much it cost me, $4.99 with discount for $25. It cost me $4.25 for 10 scrunchies. No, 12 scrunchies. And so, Yes, these ones are a little bit smaller. Like they're not the huge, big ass, fluffy ones for sure. But I don't even like those. Like I don't like when they're big. Like I just don't have enough hair, I guess. So my pro tip is buy your scrunchies online, dude. Each scrunchie 
was like 30 cents. I don't know. Can't go wrong, man. I kind of want these two colors on my wrist right now because like they're just fun. They're kind of like little bracelets, you know? Makes me feel like I'm young again, you know? And then the last thing that I bought is so random. But they popped up in my feed and I was like, I want those. I want those. I want those. So I bought them. This is a pack of 40 balloons in my brand colors. When I saw the whole package was like navy and gold, I was like, I freaking need that. Like, what the heck? So cute. So it has like some of the balloons with like the little thingies in them. Okay, before I go, I had to come on here because I just tried on the red one and I love the color and everything, but I'm kind of sad that I didn't just stick with the large because the body part didn't shrink that much like from the large to the medium, but the sleeves got a lot shorter and your girl has long arms, so that kind of sucks, but it doesn't really matter. It's still very, very cute. Sleeves are just a little bit short, but it's all good in the hood. Okay, bye.